Hello, I'm Angelism, and welcome back to Rimworld Needs You, where we are somewhat surviving right now. Unfortunately, Susan, our lovely pregnant bear. Uh, where are you, Susan? There you are. Has a minor blocked artery in her heart, a burn scar on her right eye, and is only half of her pregnancy. Hopefully she'll survive, but uh, there's nothing we can do about that blocked artery. Everyone in the comment section last video who was like, you know, pray for Susan, let's do a Kickstarter to fund Susan's operation, etc. Thank you so much, but I'm afraid that uh, we don't have Kickstarter in the future on RimWorld. I know, it's, it's such a shame. We really should get some Kickstarter going. Uh, right, anyway, let's speed forwards. What are we doing today? Uh, we need to hunt some deer, uh, get a little bit of uh, meat going. There's a couple of things we need to build. We could also do with, uh, how's our heating? I mean, it's okay. Although, even though this is, like, meant to be, what, 21? It's only on 18. Maybe putting vents into the room so that they can equalize the temperature as well. That'd be a good idea. This door here is at 7, 18. So it's doing a good job of keeping the temperature, you know, somewhat equal. One degree here. Ouch. We should probably set up a hallway or something. Yeah. The reason is, like, the air is flowing out of that door. That means, yep, Deacon's bedroom is six, and then you get 18 here. So we need to be able to put some uh, protection in. So, do we have, like, enough limestone? We probably don't. What's all our stone in? Marble. I mean, I, we can make marble wall. Sure. Um, I do need to move this, though. Oh, well, we can make it work. And then we'll put a marble auto door, because that's how we roll. And that should allow us to have better temperature uh, retention. Oh, things are dying. I think what we'll do is we'll just harvest all of our crops, regardless of if they're really ready or not. Because they're not going to grow for a while. Can we harvest these as well? One of them is ready. Okay. Now, we also need to set up uh, some snow shoveling. Because right now, there's snow everywhere. In fact, there's hard snow everywhere. So, we need to set up some orders for... Is it zones? Yeah, let's set up a clear snow zone. So... Definitely out front here. Now, people have said we need to put sandbags around the turret. And I completely forgot. That is entirely correct. My bad. We need to put some... Uh, uh, what's it called? Sandbags around it. Yes, yeah, sandbags. I forgot the word sandbags and I said it a second ago. I'm good at this game. Right, let's put you in there. In fact, I might take this opportunity to move uh, our growing zones and just standardize them a little bit more. So for now, that'll do. And I would like another clear snow zone. I'm sure I could just right click to remove zones. There we go. Right. That'll have to do. Because people are going to have a lot harder time moving around at the moment because of that. This place almost looks productive right now. It's amazing. Weird, but amazing. Now, we do need to give some hunting orders out. Don't want to hurt the grizzly bear. But we could certainly do with hunting a little bit of these guys. So... Hunt. Hunt. You're young. You're young. Yeah, you're getting old, so you can be hunted. You're four, so I'm going to cancel the hunt order on you. I want to try and, like, take out the old ones. Nine years old. That's good enough. Yeah, at least I'm alive. Kind of need them for their fur and leather. Yes, talk to that war... Uh, that war? Sorry, that uh, boar. Make the boar like you. You keep failing. Such failures. Hunting is going well. So 
Sweet. More deer. Tahoe, are you still... Body. A bite from a tortoise. Oh my god. Rear left leg, bitten off. Tahoe! It's, it's, this is why you don't pick fights, Tahoe! Tahoe's missing a leg! Poor Tahoe. There we go, we're starting our work now. Now, do we have someone who's going to do, like, snow shoveling? Like, is snow shoveling up high up? What does it come under? Cleaning? Clean, clear snow. There we go. Yeah. Okay, we should be good with that. Clear, clear. Okay, so the snow has abated. Whoa! Fault in electrical circuits cause it shorts. Oh my god. That's pretty bad. Quick, punch out the fire. Punch out the Fable, why are you on fire? Fable. Uh, oh, the miner burns. You're probably fine. Okay, so that didn't go so well. Um, power. Right, let's let's fix that power circuit. Poor Fable. All right, Fable's fully healed. Now, when we get in our next, like, injury, we're probably going to have to set our colonists. In fact, let's set them now to only using herbal medicine. Now, the reason for this is that you have to use normal medicine for an operation. And if we use a lot of normal medicine, we're going to be kind of in a bit of a difficult place when we want to do an operation. Now, I can't do anything about these sensory mechanites because it takes a long time to heal them. So, unfortunately, we've got no choice. You're just going to have to deal with it. Your sight, your hearing, your talking is going to be amazing, but everything else... Not so much. It's very hard to heal mechanites. Did you just puke in my fridge? Shulz, did you just puke? You puked in my fridge. You got food poisoning. We get food poisoning really commonly here. We need better cooking skill. Okay, how's the temperature now? Better. Still iffy. I mean, this is a very large front wood wall that's kind of exposed, but... Killer's no in longer incapable of- Killer, what did you do? Right rear leg. Oh no, Tahoe was- No! Rear left leg, yeah! Tail burned off, rear leg- Malnutrition, trivial. Bite. Oh my god. How can I feed you? I don't- I don't know if I can feed you. We'll have to see if that malnutrition, like, gets worse or not. I don't know who's meant to be doing the feeding here. We've certainly got, like, kibble. Raid. Attack immediately. Oh, hello. Oh, no. What have you got? What have you got? What have you got? Short bow, shoddy. Great bow, good. Short bow, shoddy. And a wooden club. Okay, well... I'm afraid you're yeah, all going to have to die. Right, Masters. Amazing shot. Get on it. Shoals. Somewhat of an okay shot. Joel. Absolutely terrible. Dash Gamer, you won't even fight, will you? Deccan. My good stabby person. And that leaves... Who have I missed? You can see James. There we go. Let's get you. Right. When's the turret going to kick in? A little while. Oh, what a shot! Stomach and femur. 
It just went down like a stack of bricks. Right, Deccan, your job is to attack him. <gasps> we have two captives. Tonna and Borba, right? Hello. Good at melee. Could be trained with animals. Could be trained with medicine. Reasonable cooking. Some crafting. Not great. What about you? Bit of everything. Brawler, neurotic pandemic. I mean, brawler's good. Incapable of dumb labor. Ah, uh, sorry. Fire attendant became a warrior. Greedy, abrasive, fast walker. I mean, fast walker's nice. Incapable of dumb labor is really bad, though. Do I even have a prison at the moment? Pretty sure I am now lacking a prison. Yes, I am lacking a prison. Good for me. Uh, right, let us put a couple of sleeping spots down. Prisoners. I'm going to go and get some captures in. Oh, yeah. Now, you can be stripped. We'll take your stuff. Congratulations. I'm afraid Pig gets away. And Pig had the good great bow, which is a shame because I kind of wanted that. Now, Killer, are you still malnourished? Yes, you are. I'm assuming it's because Master's the only person who can really talk to Wargs, because you need six for that. And I've told him not to. It's really not because I kind of want to train him to get better. I train the others to get better, which means banning him, because otherwise he'll do the job. I'll leave the malnutrition a little bit longer. Now, what is your, like, health like? Pretty bad. I mean, if you survive, we might recruit you, but you're both pretty badly injured. It's your own fault for attacking me. Right, how are we doing on wood? Because we are using that. We've got plenty. We're using that to stoke the boiler there. Poor killer. Okay, fine. We're gonna cancel the orders to try and tame these boars for now. Oh, that was a... Uh, I'm not sure where the boars... Ah, there we go. Cancel. There probably was another boar, because I think we're trying to get, like, a couple of breeding pairs or something. Because they can, like, haul stuff. But I guess... Work. Animal. Animal, 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 Handling. I'll put you onto two for that. Poor mood. Shulls. Why are you in a poor mood, Shulls? Depressive, feeling terrible, ugly environment, slept in the cold, lacks a bionic body part, we'll try and get you one. Wearing one out of parole, in darkness, comfortable, the very low expectations. Well, still got the low expectations working for us. Okay, we do need to improve the light situation, which probably means improving the power situation. We'll get ourselves a solar panel over here. Hook it up like that. Right, someone please, like, help out. No one's gonna help Killer. I can't really do much about your mood. I'll be honest. Killer is fully healed. Still my nutrition. 
Maybe it's just killer couldn't move so couldn't feed themselves. Well, you have to deal with the mood. Like, I can't help you. I'm sorry. There's just nothing I can do. Oh yeah, disease infection. Tona has gotten sick from infection. The infection is the left arm. Uh, you're the one that I was considering taking on. Okay, how bad is it? Minor, untreated. If it gets bad, we'll sever the arm. Maybe, depending if you're worth the medicine. You probably aren't worth the medicine. We'll see. We did get a wild boar on our side, so someone did successfully recruit a wild boar. And it's female, so we want a male boar. <gasps> it's trained by UKZ! Yes. Let's train it in all the things, UKZ. Uh, UKZ James. You are for animals. Still only a five, despite the fact you managed to successfully train one. Shame. Well, let's put you as a one, so you at least do the training that you can. Deacon's hanging out with a wild boar. Good for you, Deacon. Did you actually successfully train that? You did. Nice. We're training and hauling as well. We had so many jobs going on here. Right, I'm going to delete these zones now. Once we get back to brook growing season, we'll place them back. But maybe like better placed. Right. And let's get some orders down. And we will uh, cut these plants. I don't know if it's going to really yield anything. Clips. Goody, and I just put a solar panel down. That is such a good timing. <sighs> oh well. Bring it on. Right, how's the arm, Donna? Major. I'm just gonna release you. You're gonna go die anyway. There's no way we're healing you, and I'm not even gonna bother giving you the medicine. You're not worth it. You're like mediocre. You're you're okay just because you're a person. That's about it. What was that? I heard like a squeal. Susan's eating a squirrel. Oh, fair enough. <gasps> Masters has nicknamed Wild Ball One a snowball. Yay! God damn it, Masters. Did you have to like? It's bonded. Ah, but it's still got a different master. Yeah, you can see James. You can have that. Let's train Wild Boar 2. You are female, right? No, you're male. I've got two male boars. That's not the right combination. No, that's female. Snowball's female. Sweet. Okay. Doesn't look like we've really got anywhere with that boar yet. At least you're Snowball. You're probably going to be dead. Ooh! We successfully recruited another boar! It's male. Okay, we do need a female boar to balance this out. And named it Wild Boar 1. I don't think you really named it. Let's be honest. Well done. Did you, like, get a point for that? In animals? No, he's still five. Okay, we need a female boar. So we can match them into two breeding pairs. Ah, uh, hello. I would like to tame you. No, you won't attack me. You'll love me. You'll never want to attack me. I'm too nice. I'm too lovable. Are you doing all... That's a lot of clearing up to do, Shulls. 
But I'm glad someone's doing it. But yeah, that, that's, that's a lot of cleaning up to do. In fact, we should probably put cleaning, like, really high for everyone, because once it's done, like, it'll stay nice and clean. So I'm just going to put it on two, except for anyone who's, like, super important. So, like, Deacon. Bit too important to put on two. Deacon's got a lot of other things on Deacon's mind. Uh, yeah, that's actually reasonable. Yeah, leave it like that. Tono exceeded the map healthy. Relations with the Brexo planes have improved by 15. Yay! Let's be completely honest. She was probably going to die from that infection to her arm. But I guess she could have gone home and got that infection fixed by someone or something. I don't know. She didn't really exit healthy, though. Let's be honest. Bob, are you healthy yet? Yeah. I don't really want to add you to my group. So I'm going to release you as well. There we go. We're gonna have some more relationship. We're doing quite well now. In terms of like the temperature, it's quite reasonable. I think what we'll do uh, next time is we'll install some vents in all the different rooms so that we can equalize the temperature. We'll put a proper front on, make sure it's like double thickness to be able to keep some of the heat in. Um, we'll probably expand the freezer a little bit, build a proper uh, prison. Maybe have an extra bedroom for when we recruit someone. Yeah, but we'll we'll give it a, a proper go. And also we will sandbag the turret. Maybe even move the turret. I don't know. Wait, I can't really move it, so it's kind of stuck there. So yeah, I'll sandbag it right now because otherwise I will forget. You know me. There we go. But until then. I've been at Realistic, and this is a good place to leave it for today. Uh, if you've enjoyed, please like, not subscribe, please consider subscribe. We've got a load of wild boars on our side, and quite frankly, everybody should have a pet wild boar on their side. We're trying to give everyone a pet wild boar if we can. But until next time, stay shiny. <laughs>